Welcome to Week in Review. I'm Warren Dean, and uh, this is Jeff. This is Knox, and we have a couple of longer-term residents here that we're looking to get into forever homes for the Christmas season. Knox is one of them. And Jeff, of course, from our behavior department, I, when people come and see Knox, uh, he is a younger pup, but he does have some things on his profile that maybe people aren't sure of. He's barrier reactive. Explain to us what a barrier reactive dog is. So barrier reactivity comes from two places, typically fear and frustration. Uh, what he'll do is when he sees another dog, in Knox's case, gets so aroused that he wants to see them. So he just starts building that excitement up, 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 uh, until it develops into him barking, growling, because he's so upset that he can't go out. Um, with it, it's a pretty easy behavior to work with. All you have to do is have another dog come, come within sight range, but at the point that he's not reacting yet. And then we just do something that's called counter conditioning. So we just let him see the dog and give him a treat. Let him see the dog, give him a treat. So that all he does is learn that being calm when he sees the dog is a good thing. Okay. And then we'll slowly build that closer and closer. If we come a little too close and he starts reacting again, then we step it back and work from a further distance again. As far as somebody at home, what, what's, what can they expect and what can they help themselves to, to make it an easier transition? Uh, definitely training classes with Knox, which is uh, one of his requirements right now for adoption. Um, he's a really smart dog who likes to work for food. So he already knows uh, some of the basics like sit and down, uh, but he'll just need continued work on that to ensure that he is a good and stays a good dog. All right, well, Knox, again, he's been here over 30 days. We want to get him into a forever home. He's an adorable dog, Josh. lots of energy. So if you have a family that's ready to run and be outside a lot, Knox would be a great fit. All right, this is Sunny. Sunny's been here over 40 days now. We want to get Sunny into a forever home. Sunny's a great dog, and it's just one of those situations that we run into every now and again here at the EHS that we have a dog that just stays a little bit longer, and we're not sure why because they're such a great animal, but it just hasn't been the right time. So with Sunny a little bit older, four years old, um, still some things to work on, barrier reactivity as well as leash reactivity, being a little bit older, is it going to be a harder thing to do? Uh, it's not something that's especially hard to work with, but it does require a lifelong commitment to working on it. Uh, speaking from experience, because I actually have a leash reactive dog myself, uh, it just takes commitment. Uh, we often use something called a halty, which is a head harness, and it just allows you to kind of direct their sight line a little better. Uh, so you pretty much do the same thing as you would working on barrier reactivity. Whenever they see a dog and they're not above their threshold, so they're not showing that reactivity, the barking, growling, you start treating them. Uh, you also can build in commands like watch and wait so that they learn to just defer to you. So instead of looking at the dog, they'll look up at you and that allows you to have the other dog pass without a reaction. So it's one of those things when people are a potential adopter, they come to see Sonny, and you see these things on the pet profile, don't be intimidated by them. We have a ton of great staff here that will help explain everything to you and give you those tips to help you work with Sonny or a Knox and, and make sure that everything goes really well when you do bring them into your family. That's one of those, it's kind of the old saying where you get out of it what you put into it, correct? Very much so. I mean, most behavior problems are very easy to work with as long as you're consistent and committed to working on them. So our goal is to get Sunny and Knox into a forever home before Christmas. If you're looking for a great addition to your family, two great options in these two dogs.